then a huge spoiler warning for this video please watch arcane before this i highly recommend it it's my favorite show right now victor is by far my favorite character in arcane arcane is an amazing show and all the characters are so unique i physically can't get enough of this show as a person with a mobility disability i was so impressed with the way they portrayed his disability they didn't have characters pity Vi victor However, Child Victor finds himself isolated from other children, which I definitely relate to. I, myself, couldn't go on monkey bars and do all this the fun stuff, so, you know. <laughs> anyway, um, it was so accurate how they showed a progressive disability from him having a cane in Act 1 to a crutch in Act 2. I also have a disability with no cure, and the way Victor would literally do anything for a cure is very accurate. Also, do not get me started on the shimmer scene, and he is able to outrun the bow. That scene had me tearing up. It was so beautiful. The raw scream he lets out when he can finally run is beautiful. The emotion is so vulnerable. Like, all the screams in that show were so good. <laughs> that sounds so weird, but... <laughs> the emotion, the voice actors are incredible. Um... The parallels in the show are insane too, but for the point of this video, I'm only going to talk about Victor's parallels. Like, when he outran the boat, it parallels directly to when he was a child, and he couldn't outrun his toy boat he made, and he fell. But now he's running, and he's screaming while he's running, and he's outrunning a literal boat, which is insane. Uh, however, Victor did reach his breaking point, though, when Sky dies from the Hex Core. And again, the parallels show up from when it was Jace going to jump off the building to now it's Victor going to jump off the building. But this time, Jace stops Victor instead of the other way around. Also, before that, Heimerdinger is there and refuses to help. Not the best time. <laughs> But the quote he says is eerily beautiful. The stars that burn brightest often burn fastest. And I've seen so many edits with that. And it, the edits are really cool. This fandom is amazing. Highly recommend you join the fandom. Uh, but, you know, that saying was probably not the best to say at the time. Because Victor, you know, was gonna jump off the building. But, um, anyway... Uh, I am really curious for the next season because Victor character shifts at the end when he reaches out to the evil scientist he knew as a child who he learned a lot from and they were trying to keep alive a species by any means necessary and Victor was like baffled by this and was like why keep something alive if it's in pain and then now we finally understands because he wants to be kept alive no matter what. Uh, so he goes back to him for help, and I get why he's willing to do anything to get better. That's a very common thing. People with chronic illnesses will be willing to bargain with anything. But I'm really concerned for his character now, if he's going to turn bad with the people he's interacting with. Because uh, he's that guy is uh, helping... Uh, Soko with Shimmer and like he helped him kill Vander and so I'm just really curious for how the next season's gonna end up and I can't wait but you know I am a little upset with how the fandom is treating Victor the, with their infantilization of him because that's very common people with disabilities often get treated like children and the fandom is kind of doing that they're like saying, ooh, ooh, soft boy, baby, uh, he's Victorian child. I really hate the Victorian child jokes. Like, he'd die if he had, like, a Sprite, um, or McDonald's Sprite. And I'm like, no, no, he wouldn't. Uh, that's not really how disabilities work, but, you know, that's the only thing I have to say about the fandom right now. It is great fandom, but there's some people. But anyway, highly recommend the show. Please watch it. It's amazing. And 
look out for those parallels. And Victor is absolutely my favorite character and the best disability representation I've seen so far. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you next time. Bye!